another Yowl vlog. Uh, just a quickie here. Uh, wanted to make sure, though, that all of our subscribers, all of our viewers, know about the upcoming I-55 LAN in England this weekend. And, uh, yeah, it's it's been getting bigger and bigger. Uh, I mean, we already knew last year that this was the event to keep your eyes out for. We all knew it was coming. But at the same time, uh, we've had a lot of great support in the, the last recent weeks for this, as well as just the support from the community to make this happen. Let's let's reiterate that, that, that there's no way that this would have happened uh, without the community. So uh, definitely pat on the back for everybody that's been involved, that's been helping uh, get the teams out there, um, production, cheerleading, all that sort of stuff. There's a lot of super important stuff that goes along with that. Um, and uh, it's it's almost here. You know, now now we've gotten Ascent out there. We've gotten Froyotech out there. Um, we got uh, Alpha from the United States flying out to help out the last resort who cannot get their soldier shadow burn out there, unfortunately. Um, so matches are going to kick off uh, Friday night um, at uh, 4 p.m. local time. This is in the U.K. So it's going to start super early for those of us on the West Coast. And uh, that time actually no sorry I, I have it up over here on a second on the side i was going to just go off my memory but i believe in fact uh, i was i was going to say the wrong time i'm glad i didn't that uh the grand final starts on sunday at 2 p.m local that is bst british time and uh yeah so that's going to be a little bit early on sunday but we're super stoked for that and a uh, games all day saturday it's it's going to be it's going to be really fantastic so we're, we're definitely looking forward to uh, the tournament, to watching the action. Uh, XTV, we actually um, have some PAX coverage going on, and we're really excited about that event and the games that we're going to be able to showcase and, and all that. So after I-55 coverage wraps up, uh, why don't you tune into PAX coverage? Uh, we'll be hanging out, and we'll probably get a few uh, discussions uh, about I-55 and try to catch our viewers up with what's going on. Um, just because it's such an awesome, awesome thing. Now, uh, before I leave, I, I want to. I talked about uh, the event getting bigger, but I guess I did just. I wanted to make sure that I didn't miss um, who who the biggest contributor lately to increasing this prize pool is, and that is Backpack.tf. So, big thank you, big shout out to Backpack.tf for for contributing uh, five thousand pounds into this prize pot, and that is awesome. And um, this is super important. The, the fact that we now have organizations in the community that are beneficial for the community that people like and are able to contribute back into the community and our tournament structure, our tournament economy. Um, that is super important for our future moving forward. And um, I-55 is, is, is going to be an awesome, awesome event. Um, my prediction is that will be the last uh, super, super classic 6v6 uh, event as we know it. Because matchmaking is just going to change things around uh, a crazy amount. And hopefully by I-58, we are having another awesome TF2 event. But, uh, you know, maybe a little bit more revised rule set in order to match up with what Valve has on offer. Which will hopefully make it just an even bigger event. So, very excited for this weekend for everything that's going on at I-55 and at PAX. And uh, I'm looking forward to watching as much of those matches as I can. I hope you guys are as well. And I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend as well. I'm Eckstein, and I will see you guys next time. Peace out. Rah.